Hello all, it's your girl Tiffany, Madam Luscious Black Beauty, your poetic psychic Pisces, High Priestess, aka the light that shines like a diamond, also known as your modern day nun, one whom isn't within a coven, a confidence, or a covenant. I do thank you all for listening and for watching on tonight. If you would be so kind to please like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. This is going to be a general reading for the overall collective of any zodiac sign. So please take the messages that apply, leave the ones that do not. Remember that this reading can apply to your past, your present, or your future. Okay, and without any further ado, guys, we're going to get on to today's reading. So, um, this is going to be, um, who are you worried about reading, okay? Who are you worried about? So we have husband or wife here. Somebody is concerned about their husband or their wife, okay? We have sister or brother here. You may be concerned about your sister or your brother. We have aunt and uncle here, okay? You could be concerned with your uncle or with your aunt or your uncle. We have daughter or son here. You may be worried about your daughter or your son. We have crazy cousins, okay? And, um... Actually, got. Actually, guys, um, I was led to 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 separate these. Okay, so I'm gonna do that on the ne of the next reading. Okay. So we have here husband or wife, sister or brother, aunt or uncle, daughter or son here. Okay. So let's get some further clarification um, to see what you could be. Why are you worried about these people? Spirit, please clarify husband or wife. Husband or wife? Why is somebody concerned about their husband or their wife? Okay. So we have here your dad's side of the family here. Somebody could be, somebody's husband or wife could be dealing with some type of issues on their dad's side of the family here. Okay. Fair, so why um, is the collective concerned or worried about their sister or their brother? Okay, so we have here home is where the heart is, okay, maybe um, someone's sister or brother has left home, um, they could have left on their own or they could be missing, but we have home is where the heart is here, so I'm getting the feeling like somebody's worried about their sister or brother because they're not at home, okay. Spirit, um, why is somebody worried about their aunt or their uncle? Why is someone worried about their aunt or their uncle? We have here somebody turned their back on you. So somebody's aunt or uncle. Somebody could be worried about their aunt or uncle because this person turned their back on you or, um... Either your aunt or uncle turned their back on you or you turned your back on your aunt or uncle, but I don't uh, It's probably the other way around because, like, why would you be worried about... Maybe, I mean, it could go that way. Because I was getting ready to say, why would you be worried about them if you turned your back on them, okay? But somebody's worried about their aunt and uncle, or, or uncle, excuse me, um, because somebody turned their back on you, okay? So, Spirit, clarify, um... Daughter or son? Why is somebody worried about their daughter or son? Okay. We have here they fucked up a long time ago. Okay, so somebody's daughter or son could be getting into some type of trouble. Um, could be involved with the wrong group, the wrong crowd. The bottom of the deck, we have the stalking, riding past your house here. Okay, so I feel like somebody may be worried about a daughter or a son who is like... Um, Maybe teenage age to like early 20s, maybe mixed with the wrong crowd, kind of doing the wrong things, okay? Um, may, have, may have gotten into some trouble or doing some things that could get them into some trouble or something like that, okay? But we're going we're gonna to look into it and see what else is going on. So we clarify um, why the collective is worried about their husband or their wife and their daddy's side of the family. Why is someone worried about their husband or their wife and the daddy's side of the family, please, okay? 
So we have the world here, okay? Um, the world uh, talks about a completion of something, okay? Um, this speaks to a finalizing, okay? Something coming to an end for something new to begin. Um, something has gone full cycle, though, okay? As it relates to... Um, someone's husband or wife dealing with their dad's side of the family, okay? Um, someone could have passed away in your husband or your wife's family on their father's side, okay? And so you could be worried about your husband or wife because of this, okay? But something has come to it. Yeah, it was definitely a death, okay? Somebody's husband or wife is dealing with a death on their father's side of the family, okay? And something has come to an end in that situation. So we're clarifying um, why the collective is worried about um, a sister or a brother. And home is where the heart is. Okay. Why is someone worried about a sister or a brother with home is where the heart is. Okay. So we have tea time here, okay? There could be some type of gossip going around, accusations, um, blaming, shaming, rumors, speculations, um, something going on, okay? Scandals, um, somebody is talking. This this is gossip, okay? Um, maybe going on with some, about someone's sister or brother here, okay? Whomever um, that is worried about their sister or a brother with home is where the heart is. This person may not be at home or um, I feel like is like excommunicated from the family or something like that. There's a lot of gossip and talk that's going around about this person. So somebody may be uh, worried about a sister or a brother because of this. Okay. So we're going to clarify um, aunt or uncle. Why is the collective worried about their aunt or uncle with someone turned their back on you? Why is someone worried about an uncle or aunt or uncle with someone turned their back on you? Okay. So we have my witchy twitchy card here. Somebody's um <laughs> with the witchy twitchy card here, this speaks to the dark arts. Okay. This speaks to blood sacrifice, rituals. Well, it can speak to a multitude of different things. Okay. Black magic, voodoo, spells, curses, Satanism, witchcraft. Uh, devil worship, secret societies. Um, somebody's aunt or uncle is either into the dark arts. Um, it could be a witch or a warlock practice uh, black magic voodoo. And turned, and so they turned their back on you because of this. Or either somebody is into witchcraft, sorcery, black magic, and voodoo. And this is why your aunt or uncle turned their back on you. Okay. We to clarify um, why the collective is worried about a daughter or a son with they fucked up a long time ago. Why is a someone... Okay, I see what's going on. Okay, so we have here the full card, okay? Now, this is my careless, reckless careless and recklessly living foolish card here, okay? Somebody is being... Um, Somebody is being very childish, okay? Being silly, they're unreliable. Somebody could even have a low IQ, okay? Um, somebody blindly takes leap to the faith. This speaks to stupidity. They're acting a fool. They're being foolish. They, they're um, dibbling and dabbling in, in, in risky behavior. Just a lot of ignorance and childishness here, okay? And they're making foolish mistakes, okay? Um, which is why someone is worried about their daughter or their son, okay? Okay, guys, so let's go. Let's get some, uh, see what else is going on with the situation. Spirit, clarify for us, um, husband or wife with daddy's side of the family in the world. Husband or wife with daddy's side of the family in the world here. Okay, so yeah, we have coffin here. Like I said, somebody's, um... Somebody, husband or wife, uh, had a death in the family on their father's side, okay? And so you're worried about your husband or your wife because of this. Maybe your husband or wife is taking it really hard, okay, um, because of this death in the family. So we clarify sister or brother with home is where the heart is and tea. Um, 
and the tea card here. Okay, so we have occupation here. Somebody's worried about their sister or brother because of the occupation that they have, something that they do as a job, as a career, as a hobby, as an occupation, as a trade, okay? There's a lot of gossip, a lot of talk that's going around about somebody's sister or brother and the occupation that they have, the work that they do, okay? Um, and this may be why somebody is concerned about their sister or their brother, okay? Because of all the, um, uh, the talk rumors that's going around um about this okay spirit clarify aunt or uncle with um somebody turned their back on you and the witchy twitchy card please mm. you, somebody um yeah, that's what I thought. I have an official person here. Somebody's aunt or uncle is in the military or works for the government or they're married to somebody who's in the military or works for the government, okay? Um, and they could be a part of some type of secret society, Satanism, devil worship, uh, okay? They had to turn their back on you, okay? Because of this, or this is the reason why they turned their back on you. Because they're they're into some type of Satanism or devil worship here, okay? As well as they're either they work for the government or the military, or they're married to someone who whom is, okay? And this is the reason why they turned their back on you. Especially if um, you should be concerned and worried about this. If you are someone who's a truther, who's a truth teller, you're outspoken. If you're awakened, um, if you are a targeted individual, your aunt or uncle turned their back on you. This is the reason why your aunt or uncle turned your back on you. They belong to some type of secret society or they're married to someone who does. Which technically means that they are too. Um... And they had to distance themselves from you because of this situation, um, because of the satanic powers that be, basically wealthy persons in power here, okay? Um, Spirit, clarify daughter or son. Why is the collective worried about their daughter or son with they fucked up a long time ago and um, the fool here? So, yeah, we got thoughts. Somebody is thinking about their child a lot. They can't stop thinking about their daughter or their son, okay? Okay. Um, Somebody feel like their their child is living carelessly and recklessly. Um, that they're acting a fool or being foolish or having some type of risky behavior in some type of way or being childish in some type of way. Um, and so somebody can't get their minds off their son or their daughter, off their child here, okay? Because of this, yeah. This has somebody in despair, okay? Somebody cons is concerned and worried about their child, okay? So, let's see what else is going on, guys. So, we're clarify husband or wife. Why is the collective... Why is the collective concerned? Well, yeah, we got death here. It's a death. Just plain and simple. And that husband or wife situation, somebody's worried about their husband or wife because there was a death in the family, okay? And somebody's husband or wife is taking it really, really hard. So we're clarify sister or brother, okay, with um, a tea time occupation and home is where the heart is. Somebody is surprised. Okay, so we have here surprise. Somebody could be surprised at the work that their sister or brother do, is shocked at the work that their sister or brother do, okay? Um, you know, they may have heard through the grapevine the kind of work that their sister or brother are doing, the occupation that their sister or brother is into because uh, gossip and rumors is going around, okay? Um, and they're shocked. They're surprised, okay? They probably have even went to go and see um, what type of work their sister or brother is doing, and they could be shocked by this. They could be surprised by this, okay? And this is why somebody is worried, uh, you know, thinking about or worried about uh, their sister or their brother, so to clarify, aunt or uncle, aunt or uncle, yes, yeah, somebody is definitely, somebody is definitely um, military, where'd it go, it went back in the deck, 
somebody is definitely um no, sorry it went back in the deck so we're gonna keep shuffling okay um somebody is definitely military uh as as a, a reference your your aunt or your uncle or they're married to somebody either they used to be in the military or isn't it currently in the military or they are married uh, to someone who is in the military okay they could be married to and i keep seeing wealthy men want to come out somebody is married to someone who works for the government or who is in the military that is a wealthy yeah we have soldier here with official person this is the reason why your aunt or your uncle turned their back on you they belong to some type of secret society they partake in some type of uh, Satanism or witchcraft or dark arts or um, something. And they they turn their back on you because of this. Okay. It's quite interesting because they could be trying to. They also could have turned their, isolated you and turned their back on you because they were trying to sacrifice you, use you as a sacrifice. They were trying to target you and use you as a sacrifice as well. Is what I'm picking up with this situation. Yeah, for money. So we're clarified daughter or son. What they fucked up a long time ago. The fool and thoughts. Daughter or son. What they fucked up a long time ago. Oh, shit. So we have servant here. Somebody's daughter or son is a prostitute. That's why spirits say they fucked up a long time ago. Somebody could have been busted for soliciting or something. Okay, but this this person, whether it's a daughter or a son, they live very carelessly, very recklessly. Okay, um, they're very childish, ignorant, very silly. They got some risky behavior. They're acting a fool. They're being very few foolish. They're doing a lot of things that they shouldn't be doing. Okay, they blindly take leaps of faith without uh, worrying, without looking. Okay, but this person definitely is like a sex slave, a prostitute. They perform duties for money. Okay, and this is the reason why somebody is worried about their daughter. And it's interesting how I got these cards here because I see nothing but daughter so this is somebody's daughter also with the sa same thing with aunt and uncle with the other cards here i specifically see aunt somebody's aunt turned their back on them and it's because they're married to either they're in the military or they're married to somebody who is in the military okay and they're part of some type of secret society or witch coven or satanic cult or something okay i specifically see sister here somebody's sister um your sister Could be could be gossiping about you, talking about you, or even worried about you because they're hearing the gossip about what you do for an occupation or for work. They could be surprised or shocked by this of what you do for work or something. Okay, I specifically see husband on uh, the first card here. So somebody's somebody's worried about their husband because their husband uh, is dealing with a death in the family on their father's side. Okay. Okay, guys, so let's pull some tarot real quick, and we're going to close this reading out. Spirit, please clarify husband or wife. Husband or wife. There's definitely some negative energy around that situation. Somebody got hurt. There's a lot of... Uh, there was something... Something was going on in secret. Somebody could be lying about something. Yeah, that's what I thought I seen. We got the moon here. Something was something is going on behind the scenes, behind closed doors, in secret, in darkness, um, that caused somebody's death. There was something malicious going on behind the scenes, and it, it is the cause of this person's death. Okay, spirit, clarify, sister uh, or brother with tea time, occupation, surprise, and home is where the heart is. Somebody's, somebody, um, hmm. Those of you who's worried about your sister or your brother, you shouldn't be worried. This person is a hierophant, okay? This person is a leader. This person is a hierophant. They heal others. They help others. They teach others. They guide others. They're in their life purpose, okay? Yeah. 
we also we have the hierophant magician here six of uh six of wands here whoever your sis whoever's worried about your sister or your brother they're going to come into some type of success triumph or victory they're because they're a hierophant and they're a master magician but not like in no trickery like malicious evil cast a spell on you type of magic this person is a high priestess like this person is literally a high priestess they have they hold secret information secret knowledge this person is in their life purpose and this is what the why there's gossip this gossip and talk that's going around about this that the fact that this person is a hierophant this person is a magician this person is coming to some type of success triumph or victory here okay you could be shocked or surprised by this you may not have ever known that your sister or your brother was capable of the work that they do but now you know there's no reason to be worried about them though they're a hierophant they're a magician they're a high priestess yeah they're a star whoever your sister and brother is is a star like this a hierophant magician six of wands high priestess and the star came out on your sister or your brother or whoever this is and this person is very giving very generous okay with the six of um coins here at the bottom of the deck the, whoever your sister or brother is this person is giving unto others this person is not selfish the six of coins talks about giving and receiving whoever your sister or brother is when they give they don't worry about what they gonna get in return or if they're gonna get something back this person is very giving very generous very helpful So no reason for you to like to worry about them so if you're worried about them in a in, a, in a, a bad way you shouldn't be spirit clarify aunt and our uncle when somebody turned their back on you the witchy twitchy card official person and soldier yeah ain't that a bitch death and the ten of coins somebody on or uncle turned their back on you because they were trying to sacrifice you they were trying to have you killed for a large lump sum of money they wanted to use you as a sacrifice now they're sitting up in mental conflict here they can't sleep they can't eat they can't think they're being haunted and taunted by ghosts of the past here because they're dealing with some type of sadness and loss here somebody's aunt or uncle literally turned their back on you because they were trying to sacrifice you for a large lump sum of money so that they could come up this is, yeah, fear say this betrayal. Ten of swords, betrayal. They tried to betray you. They literally stabbed you in the back. This could be your aunt and your uncle. They both, your aunt, and you could, somebody has an aunt and an uncle who were both in the military, okay? They could have even married persons in the military. But they're a part of some type of secret society. A witch coven, satanic cult, devil worship satan is of something i don't give a damn if even on the surface they like hallelujah thank you jesus praise the lord they're in a secret society and they worship lucifer as their god okay they offered you up as a sacrifice for a large lump sum of money now they're being haunted and taunted now they're having sleepless nights okay because of the sadness and loss you're never going to talk to them or deal with them ever again but if you did know now you know baby if your aunt and uncle, if you, if you, I feel like whoever this aunt and uncle is, they were your favorite aunt and uncle. You literally would have done anything for them. And they turned their back on you in order to, to, and, 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 and it set you up to be targeted, isolated, so you could be killed for the purposes of money. Whoever this is, this was your favorite aunt, your favorite uncle. Very clarify and I feel like it's both I feel like it's both specifically an aunt very clarified daughter or son what they fucked up a long time ago the fool thoughts and servant yeah somebody's daughter or son is going to be arrested or they did get arrested or they could be on the run right now yeah Either your daughter or son, you're worried about them because your daughter or son is on the run because some some uh, 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 there was a major tower that collapsed. Something happened tragically, suddenly, out the blue, all of a sudden. Okay? Yeah. Somebody could have... Yeah. 
Your daughter or son could be feeling very defensive right now, feeling like they need to protect themselves, they need to shield themselves, okay? Somebody could be trying to kill them. Or they have hurt someone or tried to kill someone. Yeah. They're on the run with a group of people here. Three or more people. They're on the run. Spirit say that's the truth. That's clarity. This is the reason why you're worried about your daughter or your son. They could be an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. They're... Mm -mm. Either they were arrested because something tragically happened with the blood sacrifices of someone else here, but it seems like that they are on the run. Some There was a major upheaval. Something happened suddenly, out the blue. A tragic situation occurred. And your daughter or your son is on the run now, feeling like they need to defend themselves, they need to protect themselves here. They could be on the run from the police, from the cops. Okay, and this is the reason why you can't stop thinking about this is the reason why you're worried about them But they are a part of some type of group. It's like three of them Okay, this could be like a, they could be a part of some type of prostitution ring or this could just be a group of friends that they're on a run with They could prostitute together whatever whomever this person is. It's that they're coming out as a knight, a knight of coins Capricorn Taurus or Virgo Yeah, spirit clarify husband or wife Clarify husband or wife. Husband or wife with daddy's side of the family. Coffin, death. So somebody's dealing with heartache and loss in this situation because of uh, somebody's death. Somebody, There was a death on, on um, your husband or your wife's father's side of the family. And they're dealing with a lot of heartache and pain right now. A lot of heartache and loss right now. Spirit, clarify sister or brother. Sister or brother. Spirit is telling you to rejoice and to celebrate your sister or your brother. Okay. You should rejoice and celebrate. You're, there's accelerated motion. Okay. We have intuition here. Whatever occupation your sister or brother do, they do, they do so with their intuition. Okay, some type of uh, fulfillment of wishes is happening for them. Whatever work that they do, they, they use their intuition to do so. Okay, they could be psychic, a medium, highly intuitive, empathic. Okay, this could be a multitude of different things, but whatever that they do, they, they apply it to healing and helping, um, awakening, guiding, teaching, counseling, uplifting others here. Yeah. Somebody's sister or brother, it speaks the truth. Okay? Could be a truth teller, truth speaker. Spirit clarify aunt or uncle with witchy twitchy. Um, official person, soldier. They turned their back on you with the death card. Ten of coins. Yeah, we got the waiting game here. They were literally sitting around waiting to get word that you were dead so they could get their payout. Okay, now they're going through some type of emotional withdrawal, okay, from the situation. They literally could have planned, plot, scheme, set this up years ago, okay, to set you up. And they've been sitting around waiting. Spirit, clarify... Uh, Daughter or a son with the fool servant thoughts and they fucked up a long time ago. Okay. Your daughter or son is in mental conflict here. Okay. They could be under the influence of some type of substances. That's like uh, um that's like um um, altering their state of mind is what I'm saying. We have partnerships and alliances here. So I told you with the three of cups here, it's up to three of them who's like on the run together, doing what they do together here. There was definitely some type of conflict or defeat in this situation or there will be here. Somebody could get hurt in a situation. Okay. Yeah, because there's some type of disruption here. 
there's this there was a disruption in some type of situation okay conflict and defeat disruption here even on this card remember i told you i seen the three of cups is partnerships and alliances is a number three on this card i know the light is kind of dim here y'all may not be able to see it okay but um they're they're with uh two other people it's three of them okay they could be suffering in silence over a situation though okay We have destiny at the bottom of the deck. This lets me know that all these situations that we just spake about is destiny. These things were destined to happen. Okay? These things were destined to happen. Okay, guys? So let's get um, one more clarifier to wrap this reading up, guys. Spirit, please clarify husband or wife. Husband or wife. Husband or wife, please. Okay. So we have the three of swords here. Well, this is the three of air on this card here, okay? Somebody's dealing with some, some sorrow, okay? Heartache, pain sadness loss somebody's trying to heal okay because of a death spirit clarify sister or brother sister or brother sister or brother sister or brother somebody could be coming into some of somebody's sister or brothers coming into some abundance whoever sister or brother this is because of their work Okay. Yeah. So my sister or brother's hope, wish, or dream is coming true here with the nine of water. Okay. We also have the eight of earth and the ace of earth, which would be the ace of coins and the eight of coins and the traditional tarot deck. So they're coming into some type of abundance because of the work that they do. Okay. Which is a hope, wish, or dream come true for them. Okay. So there's really no need for you. Yeah. They may be coming into some type of partnership or commitment or, or something like that, okay? Happiness, abundance, new beginning, success, recognition, okay? So we're clarify aunts or uncle, okay? Yeah, your aunt and your uncle was working behind, were working in secret behind the scenes against you, behind your back here with the moon card being here, okay? Um, you listen to your intuition about these things here. There was a lot of illusions, okay, um, around you, okay, but you came to a clear revelation of what was going on and what was happening and what was being done to you. This could have caused you extreme feelings and overwhelming emotions when your aunt or your uncle turned their back on you, okay? Yeah, because you went through an awakening. You awakened and you realized what was going on, what was really happening here, okay? Um... Yeah, there was definitely, the, the, yeah, they purposely caused you conflict in your life. They purposely caused conflict in your life here, and they were doing magic on you. Witchcraft, sorcery, black magic, voodoo here, your aunt and your uncle. Spirit, clarify uh, daughter or son here. Clarify daughter or son. Clarify daughter or son. Somebody, whoever daughter or son that's dealing with this is in mental conflict. They're having sleepless nights. A lot of negativity is around them. They're worried, okay? They're stressed. They're depressed by the situation that they're dealing with. They could even be with a man, a king of air that's controlling them. This could be their pimp, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini persons that they're with that's controlling them, manipulating them. What else is going on, Spirit? Yeah. This person makes all the decisions. They're definitely with an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. The person who's worried about their daughter or their son that's a prostitute. Okay. What else is going on? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Something is going to come to an end with the situation. Something's going to come to an end with the situation. Um, yeah. Either it's going to either they're gonna get caught up legally, okay, in a legal situation, or uh, somebody may lose their life in a situation. But something is gonna to come to an end for something new to begin here, okay. 
but there's a lot of sadness and loss, disappointment and regret that someone's daughter or son is dealing with here that is going through that's having to deal with these things here. Okay, guys? So I do thank you all for listening and for watching. Okay? This is um, Who Are You Worried About reading. If you enjoyed the reading, please like, share, and subscribe. For those of you who would like to contact me, you could do so at tiff.diamond.36 at gmail.com. You can follow me on Instagram at shinebrightlikeadiamond36. And for those of you who are interested in donating to the channel, it is greatly, greatly appreciated. You can do so um, through Cash App, which is dollar sign tiffdiamond36, or through PayPal, which is paypal.me slash at 36diamond. As always, guys, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, but most of all, take care of your babies, honey. Remember, this is a wicked, wicked world that we live in. There's wickedness in high places, and there is evil that is lurking around each and every corner, even in a neighborhood near you. So y'all watch your surroundings. Watch the company you keep. Watch the surroundings and the company in which your children are in as well. And considering the fact that you never know when someone may betray you, backstab you, try to hurt you or harm you, honey, keep you some protection on you. Y'all stay awake, stay aware, stay vigilant and stay prepared because if you stay ready you ain't got to get ready baby until the next time peace love and light namaste i am that i am created in the image of god